Hello everyone and welcome to my young and restless official channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Spoilers for Young and the Restless indicate that Claire Newman has been difficult for Katie Abbott to accept as a legitimate family member, but Victoria Newman is undoubtedly hoping that things will improve for the new sisters. Victor recently confided in Katie about his experience growing up in an orphanage and speculated that Claire had the same loneliness as a Cole Jordan. Victor and Katie's conversation appeared to have an impact but it doesn't indicate that everything will be fine moving forward. If Claire pushes too hard or unintentionally crosses a line, Katie can easily lose her cool again. Fans of Y and R will remember that since Claire works as Harrison Abbott's babysitter, Katie offered that she move in with the Abbott family. Victoria shot down the notion right away, but perhaps it's not so horrible after all. Katie might be finding things more difficult because Claire is standing right in front of her at the small tack house. Maybe some distance would help Katie come to terms with her situation and help her reach a state of acceptance. In any case, if the family problems at the tack house worsen, it's easy to see Kyle Abbott extending an invitation to Claire to come in. Claire is most likely at the phase in her rehabilitation, when her family is no longer necessary to watch over her. In the not-too-distant future, Claire might agree to move into the Abbott Mansion when an offer comes up. Harrison would definitely like to have Claire right there in the main house, even though it's feasible she could stay at the pool house. In any case, a lot of individuals have live-in nannies, so Kyle might appear as though everything would be fine. Summer Newman would undoubtedly disagree, Stay tuned for more predictions on Summer's reactions if Claire moves into the Abbott Mansion. This might give her yet another cause to lose it. Although it seemed like Victor's talk with Katie made a difference, that doesn't mean everything will be hunky-dory from now on. Katie could easily snap all over again if Claire tries to hard or inadvertently oversteps a boundary in some way. Why and our fans will recall that Katie suggested Claire could go live with the Abbots since she works as Harrison Abbott's nanny. Victoria immediately shut down the idea, but maybe it's not such a bad one after all. Having Claire right in her face at the cramped tack house could be making the situation more difficult for Katie. Perhaps a little distance could actually be a good thing and ease Katie into a place of acceptance. Regardless, it's easy to imagine Kyle Abbott inviting Claire to move in if family issues at the tack house get worse. Claire has probably reached the point in her recovery where she doesn't have to be supervised by her family anymore. At some point in the not-too-distant future, Claire might accept an offer to move in the Abbott mansion. Although it's possible Claire could stay at the pool house, Harrison would no doubt prefer having her right there in the main house instead. Either way, plenty of people have live-in nannies, so Kyle might act like it'd work out well for everyone. Of course, Summer Newman would surely disagree. This could give Summer a new reason to flip out, so stick with us for more predictions on how she'll react if Claire ends up moving in the Abbott manse. The young and the restless spoilers say Summer could get updates on some stunning news, so stay tuned to the CBS soap. According to teasers for The Young and The Restless, Summer may get some shocking news, so tune in to the CBS serial opera. Tuesday, July 2 spoilers for Young and The Restless indicate that Victor Newman will continue to be reticent about his entire plan. Fans of Y and R are aware that Victor is pursuing Jack Abbott and Jabbit, but he will likely try to hide the specifics. But Nikki Newman might start to worry that Jack has become a target because of her, and she might start to become more wary of the feud that is forming. Victor will feel that his resentment of Jack is well-founded, but Nikki might advise her husband to soften up. Naturally, Victor will not listen to those who want to obstruct his path. Victor is eager to use Jack's own son to cause some major harm now that Kyle Abbott has joined the Glissade team. Nikki will attempt to support Jack when they reunite at the GC later.
even though she will be burdened with some guilt for his growing list of issues. After spending some intimate moments with Nikki, Jack will ultimately confide in her. Michael Baldwin will be hanging out with Diane Jenkins Abbott in the meanwhile, perhaps disclosing a few secrets. Will Michael alert Diane about the threat of Victor's retaliation and advise her to exercise caution? When Victor demanded that Michael and Diane resume their friendship, it was obvious that he was trying to manipulate the situation. But since Michael genuinely thinks of Diane as a friend, he could feel compelled to alert her to the impending trouble. Depending on what he's learned, Michael may even have information to share about the status of Kyle and Audra Charles as co-CEOs at Glissade. In any event, the week of July 1-5, to the rumors that Kyle is working for the enemy will undoubtedly spread. To strengthen their relationship at society, Kyle will be having dinner with Claire Grace, Haley Aaron, in the interim. After Kyle gets over his jealousy of Summer Newman and gets some support, he'll toast to Claire and enjoy her presence. However, Nikki Newman may grow increasingly suspicious of the feud that's rising and fear Jack has become a target because of her. Although Victor will feel his anger against Jack is justified, Nikki may warn her husband to back off. Of course, Victor won't listen to anyone who tries to stand in his way. Now that Kyle Abbott has joined the team at Glissade, Victor will look forward to using Jack's own son to do some serious damage. Nikki will deal with some guilt over Jack's expanding list of problems and will do her best to be there for him when they meet up at the G-Safe later. Jack will end up confiding in Nikki as they share some close moments. Meanwhile, Michael Baldwin will hang out with Diane Jenkins Abbott and spill a secret or two. Will Michael relay concerns about Victor's revenge and urge Diane to stay on guard? Victor ordered Michael to rekindle this friendship with Diane and clearly had some manipulation in mind when he made that demand. However, Michael truly considers Diane a friend and may feel the need to warn her about the trouble that's brewing. Michael might even have updates to pass along regarding Kyle and Audra Charles' co-CEO status at Glissade, depending on what he's learned. Whatever the case, the news that Kyle's working for the enemy will definitely blow up during the week of July 1-5. to In the meantime, Kyle will have dinner with Claire Grace, Haley Aaron, so they'll get closer at society. Once Kyle vents about Summer Newman causing custody issues and receives some support, he'll share a toast with Claire and enjoy her company. Our predictions point to Claire and Kyle's growing bond making all the summer conflict even worse, so don't miss all the erupting hostility. Don't miss all the escalating antagonism since our forecasts indicate that Claire and Kyle's growing friendship will make the summer dispute much worse. Stay in as teasers for the young and the restless suggest that Summer may play hardball with Harrison Abbott. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any updates.